look at our lawn right now just all of the beds because I told Steve not to weed them or anything like that and obviously he well he mowed the lawn he told me he would but I told him not to worry about anything else so we have to like fully weed whack all these paths just insane the wisteria was literally still like crispy and basically dead to the touch when we left and now it's insanely large this tree has sprouted fully from our barn this entire area right here is overtaken by ferns. It just looks insane here. Look at the garden. Oh my God. I was gonna come see the pigs through this fence, but I've never seen it this overgrown. Hi! Well, hi girls. How are you? Six weeks away. Your mother's back. Yeah, I'm back. I'm gonna come in through here. Hi. Hi. Yeah, I'm gonna come in. Hi, Ducky. Hi, Peachy. Hi. Hi. I missed you. Missed you so much. Greetings, loved ones, and welcome back to my channel. How the hell are ya? I wanted to film an unboxing of our wedding gifts because we just got back to Oregon literally last night, super late, and then we had all of this just piled here. I made it a little bit more pleasing looking, but our neighbor was taking care of the farm and just brought everything inside for us. Finley's here, but he's just not participating in the intro. I'm doing it for us. And then we're gonna get into unboxing all the things because these are half for him as well. Um, so this is gonna be like an unboxing video, which I never do, but I figured why not? Because we have a lot of things to unbox anyways. And I also wanted to say, not to sound annoying, but this is not everything that we got for the wedding. We have a ton of stuff still in Virginia that we got like at the wedding and then we didn't want to move it all the way across the country and then just to move it back when we move back to the East Coast in like two months. So we kept a bunch of stuff there and then we also got a couple of little gifts ahead of time before the wedding as well. So I'll show you those now. My mom gave me these for my birthday actually and an early wedding gift. These are the Wedgwood Renaissance Gold mm -hmm. China in Renaissance Blue. I think there's also a Renaissance Red pattern and then it's a teacup and saucer so cute and Finley's mom gave me the teapot for this at my bridal shower but I don't have it yet so I need to check with her on that because I don't think that she should ship it here because they're fragile and we'll just have to move them across the country like I just said I'm holding off on a lot of shipments and then um, back in what the beginning of March I think Finley went to the East Coast to visit his cousin Charlie and his grandma gave him this as an early wedding gift so it's like a silver service set so we have this amazing teapot which th this all needs to be polished she was just telling me because we just saw her about how to polish it oh cracking a little alani and then we have the little cream saucer cup server and for sugar amazing but I need to get silver polish and then I showed this in a vlog before we left but my aunt sent me this amazing cake dome topper for my cake stand and it's so cool look at the top of it Great, great, great. And now we're here, incredible. So we have a lot to open and you actually, I left my tripod in Virginia on accident and so you're balancing on top of another big box as well. So we're just gonna start opening, shall we? Shout out to all of our family and friends. This is so exciting and it feels like Christmas 2.0, but like, ah, oh, so much better. So this I already opened. This is a box of fairy lights that we got from our friends Becca and Aaron to put on our back porch here. But then I realized that I'm just gonna have to unstring them and take them off. So I'm gonna keep them until we move to Vermont and put them on our future porch. Well, this is beautiful. <laughs> so this looks like a really beautiful piece of origami. <laughs> a really good piece of origami here that we got. Do you want me to open it all the way? I know who this is from. This is from my Aunt Kathleen, I think. Should we do the responsible thing and take off all these tags? Um, you can do that. <laughs> it sucks to do, I don't want to do it all. She got us this candle off of our registry that says, Just Married. Mmm, this smells delicious. Let's crack this bad boy open right now. I can't believe it. 
we can only use this for so long, you know? Uh, after a while, people are gonna be like, all right, we get it, so we gotta light it right now. It smells like sweet matrimony. Mm. Yeah, it does. The top notes are sea salt, ocean air, smells lily like of the valley. That matrimonial bliss, am I right, boys? Yeah. <laughs> Peach, nectar, champagne, neroli, driftwood, amber crystal, and musk. Hell yeah. Lindsay sent me a photo, like a screenshot of this on our registry and was like, why is this the funniest thing I've ever seen? A just married candle. I was like, what? I wanted it, okay? <laughs> it probably smells really good. Well, here's a little pro tip. If you guys compost with your recycling boxes, like put them down in your garden and shit, all these tags and whatnot are not good for your soil. So you should take them all off and it sucks ass. But it's, if you do it all at once, then it's really the worst. But if you do it for each one you open, and it's only pretty shitty and so it's really terrible. Okay, scratch that. Finley just realized that we're actually moving out and we don't need to do that because we're not gardening right now and don't need the cardboard. So um, we actually are just gonna keep our big cardboard boxes intact for when we do move, but let's keep opening. Let's keep the party going. If you get these peanuts, you can eat them. Oh. That one's compostable. <laughs> That's how you find out. <laughs> You found out you run them under water. Woo! What's that? This is another cooling rack. Woohoo! I got one of these at my bridal shower, and then, little secret, I actually ordered the second one for myself with my Zola credit <laughs> that I had on my account. What so, did you get credit for? One of my items was out of stock, the shower curtain, so they credited my account, and then I used the money to buy a new shower curtain, which was cheaper, and this, and something else which we haven't found yet. These peanuts are pretty cool. You, you like know. them? Are you gonna eat them? There's actually a recipe where you mix a bunch of marshmallows with them, put them in the oven for 10 minutes, and you get a really delicious Rice Krispie treat. Wow. Definitely try that, guys. Definitely, Definitely try, try that. that. We really recommend. Rue, when are you getting married? When are you getting married, you little snake? Rue, when are you gonna marry this squeaker snake? Five squeaker snake that she got for her second birthday. Woo, what's that? Oh, this one's from um, Kara, our friend Eddie's new girlfriend. Thanks, she sent, Kara. yeah, thanks, Kara. She sent me a little extendable um, shower caddy. Funny enough, this was actually the one that I was using at our Airbnb. Looked pretty nice. It's really nice. I can't wait. This is like pure bliss for me. Ooh, this is from, oh, I forget. This is either from Gina or from Tim. So this is a rain tarp. This for is the hammock. hammock. This is the straps. That's a rain tarp, so you can sleep in the rain with it somewhere. Well, actually, I don't think anybody got the hooks, but that's okay. No, no, Tim got the hooks. Uh, well, the hooks are somewhere. You can also get, like, under quilts for it. You know! Woohoo! So we registered on Zola, and then because the Zola registry selection was pretty slim in the way of manly man products and things that Finley actually wanted, we also registered on Amazon. That was like our little additional thing that we added on and we just were searching for certain brands that Zola didn't have. Like they didn't have a certain brand of bidet that we wanted to put on our registry and they didn't have like a snow blower that Finley wants for Vermont. So he was like registering it on Amazon, putting those and then you can link those to your Zola wedding website. So that's what we did. Our friends Mike and Mindy sent us the expansion pack of what do you mean? It's the office version. Woo! These are our fancy napkins that we already have one pack of from my parents for my birthday. Our new navy blue 5-2 napkins. So we have, I think, 12 total. Oh, dude, this is um, a wedding gift from Sophie here in Oregon. She goes by both, Sophia and Sophie, so I'm calling her both. Actually, I should pick one. Sophia um, messaged me on Instagram and she said, I just got this new book, this Fire Cider by Rosemary Gladstar. I was like, oh my God, I know it. I make it all the time. And she said, this is 101 recipes with apple cider vinegar from her and I'm gonna send it to you as a wedding gift. I said, Gang, yes, absolutely. That's incredible. So that was really nice of her. What's next? A little sneaky peek, get the party going. Woo, our new shower curtain. Amazing, I can do Maybe I'll even do this today. Our whole bathroom revamp. Good material on this. Yeah. Bath bliss. More like marital bath bliss, am I right? We also got a two pack of shower curtain liners because I mean, I'll show you guys how disgusting ours is now. We've been using it for over five years, five and a half maybe. And it's just, I've tried to clean it so many times, it's disturbing. We also, I forget who got us these, but we got corn holders for grilling corn and eating it. Hell yeah. What's this one? Oh, your carabiner clips. 
for the Eno. Oh, these are our napkin rings. They literally sent tiny little napkin rings in that big ass box. That's all that was in there. This and that. That's insane. Crane Barrel, you need to do better with your packaging. At least Zola has something that says, we don't do gift wrapping or like extra packaging to save on waste. But Crane Barrel did not have that option. Ooh, I know what these ones are. I'm really excited about these ones. These will also be part of the shower revamp. Actually, I should probably film that separately and put it on Patreon. Some fancy towels from Ma Talk. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Matalk? There are O towels for the Orstroms. Check it out. These are really comfy towels. These are the hand towels. We got four big towels, four small towels. That's great. These are from Georgina, his little sister. Thanks, Georgie. That's our new bath mat. Bamboo bath mat. Incredible. Our other one that we have now upstairs is very moldy. Should have been replaced a while ago. We got an inflatable kayak. That's terrific. This is from my BFF and bridesmaid, Abby's mom. Thanks, Carm. The Explorer K2 two person sit on kayak. 10 foot three inches by three feet. A little inflatable moment. Wow. Oh, only 400 pound max capacity, Rui. You won't be able to join us. Oh God, Rui. Yeah. Unfortunately, you can't get on. Let's open this one. This is what you were just balancing on. This was our first registry gift that we got to the house from Bob and Dina, our friend Stefan's parents. Our new cooler. The living room is insane right now. I need to get up just to show you how insane this is. 105 cans. 105 cans can fit in that thing? That's a lot of beer. I drink so much beer. Wow, Rue. You're queen of the world. Well, everybody, my camera's on low battery, but this is what it looks like in our living room right now. My umbrella light is still in the back. I changed angles just because I needed to um, put you up on a higher surface because my freaking tripod's still in Virginia. I'm gonna get it shipped back here though. Ow, I just punched the box. Anyways. Thank you so much for watching our great big unboxing for our wedding. Thank you so much to our friends and family for sending us all of this amazing stuff. Honestly, a lot of it too, I didn't even ship to the house off of the registry, like the bigger stuff. And I was choosing just to ship some of the smaller things. And this is everything that we have. So I'll end up showing you probably um, more of our wedding gifts over the course of future vlogs when we're actually on the East Coast and I can share all of that with you. Um, but we're here in Oregon right now with all of these things. So I figured that I would just film this and let you know what the hell is going on and do a little unboxing because I literally never do unboxings and sometimes they're kind of fun. Although they do have a lot of waste involved. So we're gonna deal with all of this, see what we can reuse when we move. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. I'm going to film actually a bathroom revamp today, I think for Patreon with the stuff that we got from our registry. So I'll link my Patreon on the screen if you're curious about all of that. And I love you. Thank you so much for watching. And again, thank you to all of our friends and family. You're the fucking best and our wedding was totally wicked. Best weekend of my life. Okay, stay smiling. Bye y'all. <laughs>